This researcher is playing the part of a quadriplegic, paralyzed from the neck down. He's able to control his wheelchair with a simple sniff. Scientists in Israel have invented a device that allows people to operate computer-controlled equipment just by sniffing, a chance discovery that could change the lives of millions, says Professor Noam Sobel of the Weizmann Institute. Basically, in a, very, in a completely different study, uh, we noticed that people can use their sniff very accurately to activate a device. And uh, we didn't just took that to any other device they could activate even outside of the study, for example, a computer or a wheelchair or anything else. The device works in the same way that a mouse controls a computer or the push of a button activates a machine. The user's nostril is connected to a pressure sensor. The sensor measures changes in air pressure. These are converted into electronic signals. So two sniffs in tells the wheelchair to move forward, two sniffs out tells it to reverse, one sniff in says turn right, one sniff out says turn left. Well, one of the things I like about this project is that it's not high-tech, it's low-tech. And, and that's a good thing in this case, right, because it's very simple, it's very robust, it's very cheap. All those things stem from the fact that it's low-tech, it's simple. And it's just something simple that people, for whatever reason, didn't notice before. The device has also been tested on quadriplegics using it to write or play computer games. The tests showed they played at nearly the same speed as healthy people using a mouse or a joystick. It was also tried out on so-called locked-in patients, people who are completely paralyzed but with minds that are still functioning normally. Some of them were able to use the sniffing device to communicate with their loved ones. Implications that go way beyond the wheelchair. Martin Benedict, The Associated Press.